All right, first fish of the day, and it is a walleye, and man, did he want that bait. All right, let's give you a little bit of line. Sorry, camera was off. It's been a little bit of a slow start. And that is on Liquid Mayhem's new plastics swim bait. Boy, he took that deep. Open your mouth. Let go. Let go. You like the scent? Just a little guy for the first one, but better than nothing. All right, let's let him go. Woohoo! So I was just about to downsize my bait when that guy bit, so I have missed a couple and I think it's because I'm running a little too big. Oh, there's a, oh, there was a hit. Ah, ha, ha. Maybe I don't want to change my bait yet. Fish on. Nice. Oh, some head shakes there. Could be a pike. Nope, that's a walleye. Huh. Nice. Well, that's what I like to catch. Or that's kind of what I'm here to catch. Oh yeah, not a bad guy. Not a bad guy. Bring them over. All right, on that FinTech jig with bio bait, perch, swim bait. Not a bad one, looks pretty. Ooh, ooh. And he's gone, tried to spike me. Vicious little creature. All right, maybe moving across the lake was a good idea. Let's see if we can keep this going. And there it is, another one. Oh, we might have found them. There we go. All right. Uh, maybe a little bit bigger, this guy. Weed through the little ones and see if we get a decent one. Again, on that FinTech jig and the BioBait perch. Nice looking walleye. Great looking fish. Look at that. Beautiful color. All right. Away you go, buddy. Sweet. I think we're about to make something happen. Might have been a weed. Trying to. Nope, that's not a weed. Oh, did you see that raw tip move? <laughs> Sweet. Nice hit. Another walleye. Oh, yeah. Good fighter. All right. 
So there's a bit of a weed bed that's down about four feet in front of me. And I'm casting up shallow and then dragging it out over that weed bed. And these guys are just stacked. And coming in and hammering it. All right. And maybe a little bit bigger, that guy. Woo, and he's gone. <laughs> All right, that's fine. I'll get back out there and catch some more. So a lot of times when I'm walleye fishing, I like to reel it up to the boat. And then I'll jig it just a little bit. There's a lot of times they'll be chasing it up. And if you pull it out of the water, it's a missed opportunity. So, I had originally forgot to do an intro for this video. So, hello, I am Jason from the Huntley Experience. And we are out on Eagle Lake, um, just outside of Strathmore, Alberta. We are here to catch walleye and maybe a few pike. Um, fishing was slow this morning and it's starting to pick up now. So thank you for joining me and let's catch some fish. Ooh, there's another one. I don't know, pike or walleye. Maybe the walleye bite turned off. The pike are biting now in the rougher water. Nope, it's a walleye. <laughs> I'm not guessing anymore. Usually I'm not that bad. All right, good. Maybe the walleye have moved out a little deeper. With the wind coming up. Getting a little breezy. He's gone. <laughs> So in the portion of the video where I was trying to show you the phone, I was trying to show you the live data from the deeper. And it was showing that these secondary points here, the fish are stacked, which is right here. There is a large number of fish stacked in here. And if we go over to the second part where we were out out across the lake you can see there as well so I had set myself up in here and I was catching them all right in here off of this secondary point these are important things to look for in the spring when you're having a hard time catching walleye especially on swim baits fish on like right away I'm just stacked over there This could be a pike. And it's holding me down. Either that or it's a decent walleye. It hasn't really started fighting yet, just keeping depth. Oh, nope, it's a walleye. Some of these walleyes fight or have seem to have a lot of weight to them. They're not super big, but chunky. That's two that I've thought were pike. <laughs> Not on my game of 
guessing the fish species today. Guys holding down another walleye trying to stay deep. Oh, it's a pike! <laughs> right, of course. Get him unhooked. 